Where are we going today, Lenny? <laughs> We're gonna see our motorcycle for the first time today. Whee! <laughs> 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 A day to celebrate! Yes! <laughs> the day is finally here. <laughs> So we're just loading up the car at the moment with a couple of things that we borrowed from my dad's bike. Got some bits and bobs. <laughs> we just screwed it off and hopefully can screw it back on on our one. <laughs> Saves us probably 200 pounds. <laughs> Whee! Whee! <laughs> Good morning world. Welcome back to our channel. Today is the day. Whee! <laughs> Today we are going to be heading to a local dealership here in Northampton called Motorcycle World where they have waiting for us our new adventure machine that's going to take us around the world. <laughs> so we are super excited to see our new motorbike for the very first time and it's a pleasure to take you along with. So let's go! <laughs> Woo! Little tornado is still going, <laughs> going strong. <laughs> We are here, Motorcycle World. My heart. <laughs> it's a beautiful day to see a beautiful bike. Oh my god, the truck's moving. So we are here at Motorcycle World in Northampton. This is a huge dealership with absolutely tons of bikes. It's absolutely a biker's dream. Here they stock Yamaha, Suzuki, Indian, Aprilia, Moto Guzzi, Herald and Kimco bikes. Absolutely loads of bikes here. So let's go inside and see what they got in store. Woohoo! Into the dreamland! <laughs> <laughs> That's a nice one here. Yeah, this one is um, Herald, which is actually a company that is manufactured in Oxford. So these are actually British bikes made here in Britain. I really want to ride that road. I think that is Monument Valley in Utah, but I'm not 100% sure. Or it's Death Valley or some kind of valley. This one is a too big for us to ride. <laughs> this one would be a very comfortable seat for you. Look at that. As long as we didn't drop it, it would probably be okay. Wow, look at this thing. <laughs> How do you call them? Um, well, I don't know, it's kind of like a trike, but it's like a front wheel trike. <laughs> a tricycle? I guess. Going around the world in one of those? That looks like a really around the world motorbike. Yeah. Moto Guzzi. It's beautiful.
it's like such a such a nice color yeah this is like the yamaha area and the overlanding beast the tenere 700 <laughs> look at that that is an adventure machine look they've got a couple of those here look at that We're gonna head upstairs and upstairs they've got all the clothing and a cafe. <laughs> our outfit for around the world. <laughs> I'm not sure that's overland practical. <laughs> Got a bunch of Oxford stuff here, Alpine stars, yeah, wow, shoey, cool. or showy, I'm not sure how you pronounce it. Really just all you need, all you need and all you want. <laughs> I think we still have to get a couple of those here for the <laughs> for the tropical rain. <laughs> yeah. It's difficult for a trip like ours because we have to kind of be prepared for like everything, all eventualities. So we need stuff for like the very south of Patagonia, but also for like the Sahara Desert. How do you pack for that? I don't know. We're going to need a lot of layers. So here is the cafe. the day <laughs> <laughs> yes because just down there I can see our new <laughs> motorbike <laughs> it's the baby which will take us around the world <laughs> beast of a bike. This is the Suzuki V-Strom 1050 XT and that is an adventure ready machine. Oh my god. <laughs> very very nice and comfortable seat for me. <laughs> <laughs> it's got the Gibby rack at the back, it's got some bars on the side to protect it. This is, oh my god. <sighs> <laughs> when dreams will come true. <laughs> so can you see yourself? going around the world on that. It's my home already. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm just gonna give you a couple of details about this bike. So it's the Suzuki V-Strom 1050 XT. It is 247 kilograms. It's got a 20 litre fuel tank. It is 106 brake horsepower, which means it can literally take us anywhere that we wanna go. But can we just take a second to appreciate how beautiful this bike is? Look at this amazing design. So this was designed by a person called Ishiro Miyata. And um, this is the same designer that did the original Suzuki's in the 1980s. So it's got that kind of 80s retro cool feel to it. And uh, guess what we've named it? We've named this bike Bumblebee. <laughs> <laughs> Bumblebee buzzing around the world. I absolutely love it. I absolutely love it. Let's fly it around the world. <laughs> <laughs> 
So that is it for today's episode. We're going to go and talk now to the specific Suzuki technicians here to learn a bit more about the bike, get to know it better. We have um, our paperwork to do, our insurance to do. We have a lot of things to do now. Thank you so much, Motorcycle World, for helping us out with this amazing adventure machine. We will surely take it around the world. <laughs> yeah, join us in the next episode where we're going to be taking this baby out to the English countryside and really seeing what it can do. <laughs> We will see you next time.